Aloha and welcome to Upside Down Pilates. Today we'll be doing a level two Cadillac workout. With us is Malia and Shannon. Let's go. All right, we're gonna start with some hip rolls with using our roll down bar. So go ahead and you're gonna hook your roll down bar up just a little bit lower than where it normally would be, maybe a little bit above shoulder height. And then we're gonna lay down and bring our hands into our bar and our feet hips distance apart and our pelvis in a nice neutral. Big breath in. And now as you exhale, you're gonna curl the pelvis under, roll the hips up and press the bar down simultaneously. Give it a go. Nice, ladies. Deep inhale to stay and exhale, soften and roll down bone by bone by bone and bring the bar back up to rest simultaneously. Good, again, inhale and exhale. Curl the pelvis under, roll up and press the bar down. Deep breath in and exhale, roll down and bring the bar back up. Deep breath and exhale, hip rolls up, bar comes down, inhale, feel that shoulder girdle stabilize and exhale, roll down. Two more please, big breath in and exhale, curl the pelvis under, roll up, big breath in and exhale, roll down. One more time, big breath in and exhale, curl that pelvis under, roll up, deep breath, and exhale, roll it down. Nice, we're gonna go into hundreds. So go ahead, bring your legs up to tabletop and imprint. Inhale, nod your chin, exhale, fold forward and reach your legs out on a little diagonal. Beautiful, inhale, press the bar. Two, three, four, five, and exhale, two, three, four, ten. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, twenty. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Breathe out, two, three, four, thirty. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Breathe out, two, three, four, forty. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, fifty. Inhale, two, three, four, five. And exhale, keep those heads still. Sixty. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, seventy. Inhale, two, three, four, five, exhale, two, three, four, eighty, inhale, two, three, four, five, and exhale, two, three, four, ninety, last set, two, three, four, five, exhale, two, three, four, you've made it, bend the knees, and lower down and rest, that felt good, I know, all right, come up, we're going to take and put your bar up to where it normally goes, and we'll do roll down with back extension, and just leave this slider here. Good, all right, feet are gonna go to your uprights. Hands are gonna be at the roll down bar and you're trying to get vertical and a nice neutral pelvis the best we can. Inhale, glide our shoulders down a little bit. Now exhale, we're gonna roll down, squeeze the glutes and hamstrings, press into the toes, nice. Inhale, gently bend the elbows and open the chest to the sky. Exhale, reach the head out, straighten the arms, nod the chin and snake through and roll all the way around it in a C. And then inhale, we roll up, sequence nice and tall. And again, roll down, exhale, curl the pelvis under, squeeze the glutes and hamstrings, press into the bar. Inhale, bend the elbows, open your magic eye to the sky. Exhale, straighten the arms, nod the chin, snake through, fold forward at the rib cage, hollow the abs up and in, nice big C curve, and then roll up nice and tall. And again, exhale to roll it down, hollow those abs. Inhale, extend the chest. Exhale to straighten the arms, nod the chin, and round all the way through. And then inhale, roll up. Two more, please. Exhale, curl that pelvis under, roll down, looking beautiful. Inhale, bend the elbows, open the sternum. Exhale, straighten the arms, nod the chin, start to snake through, a nice big C curve. And roll up. And last one, exhale, roll it down. Inhale, bend the elbows, open the chest. Exhale, straighten the arms, nod the chin, round back through all the way forward. See if you can keep that exhale going. 
And then inhale, roll up. Beautiful. Okay, we're gonna move into twist with pulses. So we'll have your hand in the middle of the bar. You'll twist open and then we'll reach back and back and back. And then we come up and then come back center and go to the other side. Okay, and we'll just do about three rounds. So left hand on, right arm is reaching forward. Inhale, twist open side and grow tall. Exhale, reach out on a diagonal one. Further two, as far as you can go, three. Good, inhale, slide yourself up, stay twisted. And then exhale, come back center. Good, change hands. Right hand on, inhale, twist left. And exhale, reach one, further two. As far as you can go, three. Inhale, come all the way up, nice and tall. And exhale, center. Again, left hand on. Inhale, twist open to the right. And exhale, one. A little further, two. As far as we can go, three. Gorgeous, come all the way up, nice and tall. And exhale, center. Other way, ladies. Inhale, twist it left. And one and a two and a three inhale come all the way up stay twisted and exhale center last round here we go inhale twist it right and reach it out one little further two connect those ribs and three inhale bring it on up and exhale center and right hand on we twist to the left inhale tall and exhale three two, one. Good, come on up, nice and tall, and center. Into port de bras so we'll just roll down, circle out and around, and as we come up, you're gonna roll right through the center of your spine. Here we go, right arm is a little bit underneath. Inhale, we roll down on the right side, circle the arm out and around. Exhale, we're gonna roll right up through the center, and the hand goes right under that bar. And then we change hands. Here we go. Inhale, roll all the way down now on the left side, circle around. And then exhale, roll through in the center. And we change hands. Inhale, roll down on the right. You can follow your arm with your eyes if you like. And then exhale, come on up right through the center. Change hands. Inhale, roll down on the left. Circle out and around, and exhale through to the center. Last time, please. And inhale, circle down on the right, nice big glorious stretch. And exhale, hollow through the center. And change. Inhale, circle it down on the left, up and around. And exhale through to the center. Nice, ladies. Okay, side bend hovers. So let's face this way. We'll have the left foot behind, hip height, and the right foot in front. Both are anchored up against the bar. And we're going to have our right palm up, and this is everybody's favorite. So we want to connect our ribs, we want to squeeze our tush, and we're coming from that underneath rib, giving us lots of support here. Let's inhale hover and exhale or let's exhale on the way up so inhale prepare exhale hover up and smile and then lower down just five exhale two beautiful ladies lower down try push this hip slightly more forward exhale three see isn't that more fun lift this hip up this foot up a little bit more i think there we go exhale four and lower oh she loves it one more exhale five C and lower down perfect other side everybody's fave can't think of one person who doesn't love it okay left foot forward right foot back and that is one of the things if it's too low sometimes it makes it more difficult than it needs to be yep and then you got to kind of shimmy in there nice Left palm up, ribs connect nice and tight. Inhale, prepare, and exhale, hover up. One, see, I told you everybody loves it. And again, hover it up. Two, good. 
and hover it up. Three. Good. Lower down. Connect those ribs as much as you can. And exhale. Four. One more, please. And exhale. Five. Woo! -hoo. Nice, ladies. All right. Come on up. All right, let us go into single leg stretch. So you're gonna drop your bar down to where it was for hundreds and for your hip rolls. You're gonna lay on your back and you'll start with your legs at tabletop and then you'll grab the bar into your hand. Remember, the further down you go on the Cadillac, the more miserable this is on your neck and your abdominals, so pick your battles. Bring your legs up to tabletop, nod your chin and fold forward. What we'll do is we'll bend the right leg in and reach the left leg out and then give a little press of our bar at the same time. Here we go, inhale, exhale, right leg in, left leg out and press, one, and then change. One, five sets, two, and two, so easy. Three, and three, two more sets. Four, and four, one more set, five, Five. Good. Put everything down. Rest a second. So we're going to do the same thing now with scissors. Okay. All right. Legs back up. Fold yourself forward. And now this time, stretch your legs straight to the sky. Right leg to you. Left leg away with the press. Go for it. And one. And change one. And two. And change two. And three. And three three, and four, and four. One more round, my ladies. Five, oh yes, five. Good, lower it down. Good morning, abs. All right, we're gonna do some toe taps with our bar under our legs. So come up, put the bar back up where you found it. And then you're gonna lay back down and wrangle your legs back over the bar. Yep. Now, you'll bring your hands to the uprights and then have them just above your shoulders and shimmy yourself down. We're gonna start in neutral pelvis and all you'll do is go to imprint as you dip your toes to the ground. You can actually have your knees a little bit apart if you like. Okay, inhale, prepare. Exhale to imprint, dip those toes down. And then inhale, come back up into neutral. Yep, and again, exhale. So you should feel a lot of work in your abdominal hamstring force couple. Inhale, bring it up. Beautiful, ladies. And three, and bring it up. And four, and bring it up. One more. And five, and bring it up. Very nice with those toe taps. Okay, go ahead, unwrangle your legs. And now we're going to do arms straight down and then right into triceps. So come up onto your knees. So this is a sequence that can be done off the back standing. We're just gonna do it kneeling today, but it would be the same thing if you're doing it standing. So grab your bar, reach those arms out in front of you, and you're gonna try and get yourself stacked up, knees, hips, shoulders, and head, all in one long line. Okay, big breath in. Now exhale, you just press the bar down. It may come to your thighs, it may come nowhere near your thighs, that's fine. And then inhale, bring it up. We'll just do five. And go ahead, exhale, press it down, two. And bring it up and press it down three every time you press hollow the abs more inhale up two more four and up last set five and up okay here's the next one we bend our elbows in we press it down we bend it back and then straighten it so Come a little bit closer, I think, and test it out the first time before we get going. So bend it in, and then try press it down, and then bend it back, and then reach it forward. So the further back you go, the more miserable this gets. So come in a little bit, make sure we can get our arms all the way straight. All right, here we go, nice and tall. Inhale, bend our elbows in. Exhale, straighten it down. 
Inhale, control, drop the shoulders. Exhale, return it back. Again, inhale, bend. Exhale, straighten. Inhale, bend. And then exhale, return. Again, inhale, bend. Exhale, straighten. Inhale, bend. Exhale, return. Two more sets. Inhale, bend. And straighten. And bend. And return. Last time. Bend. And straighten. And bend. And don't we love our roll down bar? Nice work, ladies. Excellent. All right, ladies, let's move into our push through bar. So let the roll down bar go. And then we're going to pull back and we're going to have one spring from above on our push through bar. We'll be going into teasers. So we're going to go bend the knees, extend, bend and return as our first way of doing it with our legs off from the ground in level two. So grab your bar, go ahead, lay down, and you're going to start with the bar up overhead. Remember, whenever we have the bar up overhead, we want it in between the uprights. And if it does get past, know that it'll spring out from underneath you. So when you're teaching, you do not want to be behind that bar. Legs are out straight and together. Abs are up and in. Here we go. Bend the knees. Start to bend the elbows, nod the chin. And now you're going to roll up. Once your lower back touches, you can extend the legs. Good. Start to roll back. Lower back touches. Bend the knees. And then put the toes down. And then you can reach out long all the way through. Nice. Here we go. Inhale. Bend. Exhale. Extend. Good. Inhale. Start to roll back. Get the low back down. Touch the toes. Exhale. Extend. Three more. Inhale. Squeeze those knees tight. Nod the chin. And exhale. Reach it out. Low back goes down as you inhale. Touch the toes. Exhale. Extend the arms and lower the head. Two more. Inhale, bend, roll through imprint, exhale, extend, inhale, low back down, toes touch, exhale, press, last set ladies, inhale, bend, nod the chin, exhale, extend, and low back goes down, and press it out, very good, all right, carefully bring the bar up to rest while you have control over it, of course. And we're going to go into half swan. So you're going to now take the bar in one hand and flip yourself down onto your belly. And again, get that bar just in between your uprights. Separate the legs, point your toes. I'm going to have you hover your legs off the ground a little bit. So really get the bum working. Belly button is in. We'll do four breaths today. Inhale, bend the elbows behind your head. Exhale, extend the upper body a little bit. Inhale, go back down. And exhale, straighten the arms. Good. Inhale, bend. Exhale, thoracic extension. Keep those abs up and in. Inhale, flatten back out. And exhale, reach it out too. Inhale, bend the elbows. Exhale, extend the spine. Inhale, come back down. And exhale, Reach it out. Two more sets, please. Inhale. Bend the elbows. Exhale. Extend. Inhale. Bend the elbows. Exhale. Reach it out. One more set. Bend the elbows. And extend. And bend. And reach it out. Very good. Keep one hand on the bar. Put the other hand down. Press yourself up. And then go ahead, bring the bar to rest and go into a, just a gentle child's pose to rest out your spine here. Okay. The nice fun stretch, we're going to do arms backwards. So this one can be a bit challenging for people. Uh, let's first have Shannon put her push through bar away. She's going to grab a dowel rod and Shannon is going to show us a modification. You could use a dowel rod, you could use a towel, you could use a stretch out strap or a resistance band, whatever you have. Okay. So Malia will show us how we do it with the Cadillac. You're going to bring one hand down, press the bar down, 
turn around and then bring the other hand to the bar. And then you can see how Shannon's got the dowel rod in the back and it's gonna do the same thing. Let's bend our knees, ladies, and you can have your knees about hips distance apart. So we're gonna rock back off our sits bones. So curl and rock back and you get a nice big stretch in the front of your shoulders. Good, and now you're gonna round forward over your knees. Keep rounding until you can reach this bar and you can go ahead and slide it through your hands and then press up and you can give a gentle stretch through those arms. Good, and then pull back down. And press and round back. Good, and come back forward. And then slide the bar in your hands, reach it up, and then reach it up and back. And come back down. And press back. And come back forward. And press up and stretch. Two more times. Pull down. And press back. And come back forward. And press up and stretch. And one more. Pull down and press it back and round back forward and press up and stretch good pull it back down you can let go with one hand if you're using the push through bar and then turn round and bring it to rest nice okay sit up combo everybody's fave so we're gonna do two springs and then one spring. So add up so that you have two springs on your push through bar. Huh? And then you're gonna flip around and you'll have your hands. You can either do P and F grip this way or this way. Let's go this way today. And we're actually seated. So come on up to seated. And then shimmy back. It's almost like you're under the bar. I would go back a little bit, tiny bit more. Good. And now we're going to start in a C just off from our sits bones. So this is our start and our end. Okay. Inhale, dip your sacrum down. And then exhale, come up an inch. One. Inhale, dip back. Exhale, two. And dip back and three you can also squeeze the glutes and the hamstrings as you dip back four so you get the abdominal hamstring force couple working five and six and we're doing ten because it's fun seven and these are your low abs eight internal obliques nine and ten nice okay Come up, take a spring away. It will be more fun now because you will have less assistance. So we're challenging, still using our psoas a little bit against our internal obliques, keeping the shape. So it's just a fabulous exercise if you can get it going the way we want it to go. So start rounded in a C, so start back a little bit. There's our start and our finish. Here we go, inhale, dip it back, and then exhale, one, dip it back and two, dip it back, and a three, dip it back, and four. Yep, and we're trying to keep our arms as straight as we can, five, and our face is as happy as we can, six, and always smiling, seven while we're working out, and eight, two more gals, nine, Last set, 10, nice, all right. I'm sure that felt fabulous. Okay, we're gonna do kneeling push through now. So this can also be done as a standing exercise off the back, but we're gonna do it kneeling. So hop up, and it's like going spine stretch forward with a little stretch. So arms are straight to start. We're gonna go ahead, pull our bar down, nod the chin, and round forward in a C. And you're trying to keep your pelvis stacked right over your knee, so you've got your abs up and in. Good, and now start to roll up, bend the elbows, bring the bar up, 
And now you can press forward on a little diagonal, squeeze the glutes and hamstrings, and get a little stretch in your arms. And then come back down. And again, pull the bar down, bend the elbows, nod the chin, round up and over forward. Try to keep your hips right on top of your knees. And roll yourself back up, bend the elbows. And then press forward, get a little stretch in the arms. And come back. And again, pull the bar down, nod the chin, round forward. And bend the elbows, start to come back up. And get a little stretch. Two more, ladies. Bend the elbows, nod the chin, hollow the abs, round forward. Good. And come back up. Feel how much work is going on in the glutes and hamstrings as well as in the abs to make this movement happen, that's for sure. Last time, please. Bend the elbows, nod the chin, round it forward. And bend the elbows, start to come back up. And give it a stretch. And we have made it through level two push through bar. Good work. All right, ladies, let's move into push through bar with springs from below. We'll start with leg presses. So go ahead, set up your push through bar. And remember, you always want to put your safety strap or your safety chain on when you're doing springs from below to make sure nobody gets hurt. And we're going to do leg press, so we'll use our gripper. Right in the middle. And then you can slide under your push through bar. And then you're gonna press the bar up a little bit with your hands and bring your feet up in parallel. Now, the further down you are, the more stretch you're gonna get your hamstrings, and the further up you are, the less stretch you'll get. Go ahead, bring arms down, and we're gonna try and be in parallel. Yep, I think it's okay. And press up, point your toes, and then you're gonna flex your heels, and then you're gonna point your toes, and then you're gonna bend your knees in. Your tail can come off a little bit, that's fine. Press up, point your toes, tail goes down. Flex the heels, feel that stretch. Point the toes, and then bend it back in. Again, press up and point, and flex, and point, and bring it back in. We'll do two more like this. Press up and point, and flex, and point, and bring it back in. One more, press up and point, and flex, and point, and bring it in. Good, let's keep our right leg on and now reach your left leg down onto the ground if you like, and you'll have a nice big straight leg and nice and long and get a nice stretch in the front of that left hip. Same pattern, press up, point that right toe, flex the heel, point the toe, and bend it in. Again, press up, point, we flex, and point, bring it in. Three more if we can, point, flex, point, and with your breath, we can inhale and exhale and inhale and exhale. Two more. Point, flex, point, and in. One more for fun. Point, flex, point. Good. Bring it in. Nice. Bring your left foot up. Take that right leg down when you're ready. And then again, you're gonna stretch it out long. Now you get a nice stretch in the front of your right hip flexors. Here we go. Inhale, press up and point. Exhale, flex. 
inhale point and bring it in and again point this is very nice flex point bring it in and three flex point bring it in and four flex point bring it in last time five flex point and in good all right remove that leg we are going to do military press with arms overhead and some squats so i will take your grippers you can uh, undo your springs and then take the bar out of the strap. And then you're gonna flip it around to the other side and rehook it up. Got it? Flip it around back, and then it's the same, about number two from the first one and then second one. Good. And then go ahead, grab that spring, hop it up there. Nice. All right, so you're going to get pretty close to underneath, and you're going to do a squat, and then grab your bar, and then go ahead, use your abs, and press yourself on up. Nice. And just bring it in front of you at first and align yourself. Inhale. Yes. Now exhale. Try straighten the arms. And we're trying to stay right on top of our feet. And then bend the elbows. And exhale. Two. And bend. And it can go just about eye height. It doesn't have to go all the way down. Three. And so this is great for the abs, great for the ribs. Four. And you've got to squeeze your tush as well. Five. We doing OK? Six, I can tell we're having a fabulous time. And then press it up. And eight, bend it down. And nine, bend it down. And 10, keep it up. Time for plies, ladies. Bend those knees over those pinky toes. Bend it down, keep those arms up and straighten. One, bend it down. Let's exhale on the way up. Two, inhale down. And three. Bend it down. And four. How are we doing? Are we going to make it to ten? And five. We're loving it. And six. And after this, we'll jump. Seven. And eight. But that's not until level seven. And nine. One more time. You're doing fabulous. Ten. Excellent. Bend those arms down. Good job. Moving into arm springs. Okay, so we're going to do supine bicep curls with flexion. So you're going to grab your arm springs and lie onto your back. And you can do these with either legs up at tabletop or you can do them down. We're just going to leave them down. Okay, so test it out. Do a bicep curl. Make sure that's how you want it. Good. So we'll fold forward and down five times, and then we'll stay up and do five more biceps. Here we go. Inhale. Big exhale. Fold it forward. One. And then lower down. And try to keep those elbows hovering the whole time. Two. Bring it down. And three. Bring it down. And four, bring it down. And five, stay there, reach your arms out. And one, reach it out. And two, nice work ladies. And three, and uh, four. Last time like this, five. Nice, go ahead, lower down. We're going to do the same thing with triceps. So you're going to flip around and adjust yourself for the amount of tension that you want for your triceps. So test it out before we start. We'll do five folding forward and down, and then just five staying up with our triceps. 
Yeah, is this good? Okay, again, same thing. You can keep your legs down, bring them up to tabletop, and you can do anywhere between five and 10 of everything. We're just gonna do five. Here we go. Inhale, nod your chin. Exhale, fold forward, straighten the arms. Five, lower down. Inhale, exhale, four. Bend it, and a three. Bend it, and a two. Bend it, last time. One, stay there, bend the elbows. Inhale, bend, and exhale, one. And a two. And a three. And a four, last time. One, a five. Good job, lower down. Okay, come up to seated, flip back around, and we're gonna do roll downs with our arm springs. So your legs will be out straight, and you'll have your big basket of flowers, and roll back off your sits bones, and just check and make sure you have the tension you want. So if you want more tension, shimmy a little bit further back. Okay, we'll do five roll downs, and then we'll roll down and do some more bicep curls. Nice and tall, inhale, exhale, roll it down. Inhale, stay, exhale, round forward, up and over, and then inhale, sequence up as tall as we can go. And again, roll it down, two, inhale, stay, exhale, round forward, hollow the abs, and inhale, roll up, and exhale, roll it down, three, inhale, stay, exhale, round forward, and roll it up, two more, and roll it back, four, inhale, stay, and round it forward, and roll up, last set, and roll it, five. Inhale, stay, exhale, round forward, and roll up. Good, reach your arms out in front, and give it a try, roll back, and bend your elbows, and stay. Inhale, reach, and exhale, two, and reach, and three, we'll just do five. Reach, and four, Reach and inhale, stay. Exhale, round it forward and roll up. Grab your basket of flowers. We're gonna add a little rotation. Inhale, exhale, roll back. Inhale, stay and exhale, twist right. Inhale, center and left and center. Come on forward and roll up. Now we'll go left. Exhale, roll back. Inhale, stay and go to the left and center, and right, and center, and round forward, and up, and again. Exhale, roll back, inhale, stay, and go right, and center, and left, and center, and round forward, and up. And last time like this, roll it back, and here we go. Left and center and right and center and round forward and up. Okay, we're going to do seated zombie arms. So flip yourself around and adjust however far in or out you want to go. And we're going to have our arms out and just reach up and down. We'll just do five here. Legs are out, point the toes, reach your arms out straight. Inhale and exhale, here we go. Bring it down and then reach it out and up. And again, if you want more tension, you just go a little bit further away and bring it up. There we go. And again, three and reach it out and up. And four and reach it out and up. Last set like this. Five and reach it out and up and rest. Okay, we're going to standing, ladies. We'll do some chest expansion standing. So hop off. Grab your beautiful handles. So all of these can be done kneeling on the bed. So you could be kneeling on the bed facing this way, or we can do it off standing to get a little bit more incorporation of some standing work. So go for chest expansion. Here we go. We're going to exhale, pull back. 
To the right, you're gonna sniff. To the left, you're gonna sniff. You're gonna exhale center, and then inhale, return. Good, and exhale, pull back. And sniff, left and sniff. Right, exhale, center, and then inhale, return. And again, pull it back. And we're gonna sniff right and left and center and return and pull it back. And now we're gonna go left and right and center and return. Good, all right, now we're gonna do three pulses. So you'll pull back, return center and do pulse, pulse, pulse as you exhale, 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 and then return, okay? Inhale, exhale, pull back. Inhale, center, and give it a push. One, and two, and three, and then return it back. And pull back, and bring it center. And three, and a two, and a one, and return. Last set of these. Pull back, and bring it center. And nice and tall, and two, and one, and return. Nice. Standing biceps. So here we go. Reach your arms out straight and get where you need to. Good. Inhale. Bend those elbows. Five. And reach. And four. And reach. And three. And reach. And two. And reach. Last time. One. Good, isn't that fun, trying not to fall over while doing that? Elbows back behind your waist. Try your triceps, so give it a push and see if you're okay with that. And handles will go, uh, it's kind of hard to do hammer hands, so it's better to do, yeah, there. Are we okay with our tension? So again, you want more tension, you move further back. You want less tension, you come in. Inhale, give it a push. One, and we bend. And two, and we bend. And three and we bend and four and we bend so easy last time five nice okay standing zombies five more so you're gonna flip around and test it out see where you want so as we're doing our zombies you want to try and keep tension and really you're only going up on a diagonal so make sure you have a little tension there and then back down okay and then, we are, are we okay? And you may have to lean slightly forward, but not too crazy forward. So start straight out. Here we go, inhale, reach up on the diagonal, and then press it down. Five, reach up on the diagonal, and four, reach out and up, and three, reach out and up, and two, and reach out and up, and one. Woohoo! You've made it through your level two arm springs. Excellent, ladies. Time for leg springs. Okay, ladies, we're gonna lay onto our back. We'll start with walks, and then we'll go into beats. So we're gonna bring long loops on your feet. And then once your straps are on your feet, you're gonna bring your arms up overhead on the uprights and shimmy yourself down till your arms are straight. Then you have the option of either leaving your arms up at the uprights to help brace you if you have slippery clothes on. Otherwise, you can bring them down by your sides if you want, okay? Heels together, toes apart, we'll do turned out. And let's start up on a little diagonal. And we're gonna do walks. So here we go, walk, one leg down, 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 down and then up, 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 up. And down, 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 down and up, 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 up. This is three, two, three, four. Up, 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 up. And four, two, three, four. Up, up, up. Last set and down, 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 down. Up, up, up. Up. Good, heels together, toes apart, reach out on a little diagonal, get those abs up and in for beats. And point, two, three, four, and flex, two, three, four. Point, two, three, four, and flex, two, three, four. Again, two, three, four, and flex. One more set, please. Point, two, three, four, we flex, two, three. Oh, yes. 
All right, straps off your feet. We're going to move into side lying. So we'll lay facing this way, and you'll have the front strap on your right foot. Line yourself up in one long line, and everybody is straight. So legs are out straight, toes are pointed, arm is up by your ear, abs are up and in. And we're trying to get our waist so it has a little lift underneath. Okay, lift your right leg up hip height and now circle back. Five, a one, a two, keep your hips still. Three, four, five, reverse it out. One, two, three, four, Five, good, keep that leg up hip height. Now bring the bottom leg to meet it. One, and lower the bottom leg down. And two, so the waist can go down as the leg comes up if you need to. Three, lower down. And four, we're going for 10. Keep those legs nice and straight. Five, keep your tush pressing forward. Six, keep the abs up and in, shoulders down the back. Seven, and down. Eight, and down, nine, and down. One more, ladies, 10, very nice. Okay, strap off the foot and flip to the other side. Good job. Fulcrum of the ankle. Line yourself up nice and long. Legs out, toes out, head is out, waist is up, abs are in. Bring that left leg up, now hip height, and circle it out. One, two, and three, and four, and five. Let's reverse. Five, four, three, two, one, good, keep that leg up hip height, bring that bottom leg up, squeeze it. One, and down, and a two, and down, and a three, and down, and four, and down, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and two more, nine, last time, 10. Nice, okie dokie, strap off your foot. We're gonna lay on your back and we actually need uh, to put the strap on the right foot. And now we're gonna do one leg pull down. So one leg is straight and the other leg is up to the sky. So the further down you go, the more range of motion you get. Good, and this is kind of like Grambatman dance. So the bottom leg is down, and you can do parallel or turn out. We're gonna do turned out today, okay? Abs are up and in. Inhale and exhale. Bring that down, heels come together. One, and reach it up. And two, reach it out and up. And three, out and up. And a four, out and up. And a five, out and up, and a six, out and up, and a seven, out and up, and eight, out and up, two more please, nine, out and up, and ten, oh delicious. All right, strap off that foot, let's go to the other foot. So this is really fabulous to feel the backs of those legs and incorporate the leg back down into your abs here. Okay, leg to the sky, everybody's turned out. You're pressing that right heel down into the mat as much as you can. Deep inhale and press down, squeeze the heels together. 10 and up and nine and up. And yes, you're trying to keep your hips as square as you can. Eight, and up, and seven, and up, and you're happy. Six, in case you forgot about that, 
and five and four and three and two and one bring it up okay we've made it to our ultimate fave kick back or doggy best depending on what you want to call it so let's do our right leg first we're going to be up on all fours now again remember the further down you go the more party time fun you're going to have you want the strap on your foot and then you want to be over to the left side of your carriage here so you don't smack yourself every time Head is in line, upper middle back to the sky, pelvis is neutral, and we're gonna slide out, lift up, put it down and in. Okie dokie, here we go. And slide it out, lift the leg, put it down, bring it in, and two, and lift, keep the abs up and in, and in. And this is full body fun, press lift we're trying to keep our upper middle back to the sky the whole time and four lift and down and in and a five lift down and a in and a six lift down and in very nice job seven lift down and in remember we're trying to keep our shoulder blades wide as well eight lift down two more if we can and nine lift down one more time and ten lift and down and delicious all right, take that strap off. Go into child's pose for a minute. Let your arms rest. Let your shoulders rest because we get to do it again on the other side. <sighs> Feels so good to take a break, I know. But break time's over. We get to do the other side. You're looking fabulous. We're almost there. Upper middle back wide. Ready, set, here we go. Slide it out and up and down. That was one. Slide it out and up and down. That was two. And out and up and down and three. And out, up and down. Four and out, up and down, bring it in five and out, up and down, bring it in six and out and up and down, seven, three more if you can, up and down, you look beautiful and out, up and down and in last one out and up and down and you made it take that strap off that foot you never have to do doggy busk again unless you want to <laughs> all right reach out palms up very nice good we have set up our Cadillac so that we have our trapeze all ready to go and we are going to finish up with some fabulous spread eagle off the side and some ballet stretches all right so let's go ladies hop up we're going to head over to the side toes are going to be up against the uprights and we're going to be holding on to the sides of the bars the vertical bars Stick your tush out back in a little diagonal. Here we go. Curl the pelvis under, and you're going to sequence so that you're in one long line, pulling away from the bar. 
Then you're gonna gently bend the elbows, shine your sternum to the sky. Then you're gonna straighten the arms, nod the chin, and roll through, sequence all the way through, and then reach your tail back out into neutral. Good, and again, curl the pelvis under, round through the spine. One long line, bend the elbows, open the chest, Straighten the arms, nod the chin, roll all the way back through, and extend the tail. Good. One more time. Curl the pelvis under, roll to one long line, bend the elbows, open the chest, nod the chin, snake through straight arms, and go all the way back to one long line. Excellent. All right, come out of that, flip around, and we'll go right into ballet stretches. So let's bring our right leg up onto our, our seat, and we're gonna, uh, let's go flex the foot. You can hold on, abs are up and in, and we're just gonna press the bar down a little bit, lift it up, and then press forward a little bit. You'll feel a stretch in your left hip flexors and your right hamstrings. And pull back. And again, press down and up. And press forward. And bring it back. And again, press down and up. And forward and come out of it. Good, change legs. Bring the right foot down and your left foot can come back up. Flex that foot, abs are up and in, and here we go. Press it down, lift up, and go forward and pull back. And again, push down and lift, and forward, and back. Last one, down, and up, and forward, and back. Good, let's turn towards Shannon's way, so take that foot off. You're gonna to turn towards Shannon's way, bring the right foot on the seat, and it, you'll angle it slightly in front, trying to get your hips as square and even as you can. Good, and remember these are just gentle stretches. We don't have to get crazy here. Press down a little bit, lift up, and then you're gonna shoot it out on a little bit of a diagonal and feel the stretch. And return, and you can point or flex the foot, whatever feels good for you. Press down and lift and press. And you can feel how that left leg gives you a nice push. And return. And one more. Press down and up and push out. And return. Good. Take that foot off. And we're gonna flip around, put our left leg on here. Here we go. And press down and lift and then press out. You can still feel how your abs and your shoulders are supporting you. Good, and come out and press it down and lift and press it forward and back and last one press down and lift and forward and back good carefully take that leg off now what we're going to do is turn around back and you're going to take your right leg and put it up just hook that foot at the seat. Try and keep your abs up and in. 
And all we're going to do is squeeze that right glute. And if you can, you can bring that right leg back a little bit. Just stretch the front of the thigh. It should feel like a nice stretch. But do keep it in parallel, because that'll get a nice rectus femoris stretch. And then bend it back in. And that may be a little more stretch. And press it out. And back in and press it out. And yet yeah, pull the abs up as you press the leg away. That's gonna open those hip flexors more. Good, bring it in, take it down and rest. Nice. Left leg. Beautiful, ladies. Okay, here we go. Go ahead, press it back. So leg goes back a little bit, abs come up and in a little bit. And release it a little bit. And press it back a little bit. And release it a little bit. And press it back a little bit. And rest out of it. And take that foot away. And you ladies have done an absolutely fabulous, beautiful job today. I'm so proud of you. Thank you so much for joining us today. You can check us out online at www.upsidedownpilates.com. Join us at our YouTube channel, uh, Upside Down, oh, excuse me, youtube.com slash Upside Down Pilates, or head on over to Facebook for Upside Down Dance and Pilates, and also on Instagram. Thanks so much for joining us, and have a fabulous rest of your day. Aloha. Ballet stretches aren't that bad. <laughs> <laughs>